so now let's solve few problems on the uh, delta function in three dimensional coordinate so our first problem is evaluate the integral r square plus r dot a plus a square delta cube r minus a d tau and where a is within the volume and a is a fixed vector okay so to evaluate it uh, we just need to put the value of this uh, a that is the argument of the delta function in this integral as it is already given that a is is a fixed vector and within the volume so just the answer will be r square plus r dot a plus a square delta cube r minus a d tau is equals to a square plus r dot a sorry uh, it is a dot a plus a square so it is equals to 3 a square so this is the answer okay so it is a very really a, a very simple problem so now let's uh, solve our next problem so we have to evaluate this integral integration r minus b mod of r minus b whole square delta q 5 of r d tau where v is a cube of side 2 centered at the origin and b is this vector okay now we know the uh, property of the delta function that is delta q k r is equals to 1 over mod of k whole cube delta r okay uh, delta q bar okay so now uh, e as the v is a cube of side 2 and center at the origin and is uh, this delta function is also defined at the origin with a scale factor 5 so uh, uh, we can write this like this so whole square it is uh, 1 over mod of 5 whole cube so uh, that will be 125 and delta cube r d tau okay now uh, this delta function is uh, defined at the origin so we have to put uh, 0 in this place so in place of r so the answer will be mod of b square now b is given uh, a vector 4 y cap plus 3 z cap so mod of b will be root over 4 square plus 3 square and uh, we have to take its whole square divided by 125 so it becomes 25 by 125 and the answer is 1 over 5 okay so now let's solve our next problem so we have to evaluate this integral r dot d minus r d vector minus r vector delta q r minus e d tau okay now uh, where d is a vector uh, d is 1 i cap plus 2 j cap plus 3 k cap and e is 3 i cap plus 2 j cap plus k cap okay and v is a sphere of radius 1.5 centered at 2 uh, 2 2 2 okay so so v is a sphere uh, somewhat here centered at 2 2 2 and its radius is 1.5 okay so we have to check whether this point d uh, sorry whether this point e uh, lies within this sphere or not so you know, to check this we have to uh, check the distance between its center of the sphere and uh, this e vector whether it is uh, whether this distance is less than uh, 1.5 or not so uh, for this the distance distance between uh, 2 2 2 and uh, e vector is 3 2 1 is equals to square root of 2 minus 3 so this is minus 1 square 
plus 0 square plus 1 square so it is square root of 2 and the value of square root of 2 somewhat 1.4 or something like this so which is less than 1.5 uh, so yes, and so this point E uh, lies within this sphere of radius 1.5. So the value of this integral will be. Uh, so we have to put E in place of R. Okay. So E dot d minus E. So it becomes uh, 3 i cap plus 2 j cap plus k cap dot d minus e and d minus e is so we have to subtract this d minus e so minus 2 i cap plus 0 j cap plus uh, 2 k cap okay and the dot product will be minus 6 plus 0 uh, plus 2 so the answer is minus 4 okay so now let's solve our next problem so evaluate this integral uh, i is r dot alpha minus 3r plus 2 uh, then laplacian of 1 over r d tau now we know that laplacian of 1 over r is minus 4 pi delta cube r if the origin is included and it is 0 if the origin is not included okay uh, so the value of this integral will be integration r dot alpha minus 3r plus 2 and this this part will be minus 4 pi delta cube r okay so this is minus 4 pi and now this delta function is defined at uh, delta cube r minus 0 that is that the origin so this is uh, and this term will give you 0 this term also give you 0 so we only left with plus 2 so the answer is minus 8 minus 8 pi so that's it for this video and see you in the next video